what's up to the gang i just wanted to come get something off my mind real quick and i gotta whisper because my girlfriend is asleep in the other room and apparently these walls is thin as fuck in my apartments because i can hear clearly every single conversation that my neighbors have so i'm sure they hear every single conversation that i have in my apartment and i don't want nobody um fucking spying on me or some weird shit so i'm gonna just try to keep it down on this video but this video is gonna be short sweet to the point and i know i said it every time but i've been trying to make the video short but i just be rambling because i just be having a lot to say and then i've been trying to get it all in on one you know one quick video and then it end up turning into 30 minutes so when i say the video gonna be short i try to make it short but if it's not that short you know just watch the whole thing it'd be interesting shit some of y'all like to just see me talk it's a whole list whatever but we're just gonna get straight into this i want to talk about this topic is really really serious and if you see this video you should take it serious um and I'm just gonna get straight into it. Um, I want to talk about. Um, how should I put this? I want to talk about how spirituality is about to become like the newest trend. And before I get into this video, I just want to make sure y'all are taking care of yourselves. Um, by doing everything that you enjoy doing, that you truly enjoy doing, whether that be writing, rapping, playing sports being artistic drawing painting like i like to do fuck i don't even give a fuck if you like going getting your car and take rides that just make you feel better and put you in a better headspace keep doing that shit just make sure y'all take care of yourselves because we gotta take care of ourselves social media does not help you take care of yourself your job don't help you take care of yourself you have to do stuff that make you feel good in here and in here so I hope y'all is taking care of yourselves. I really do. I truly mean that from the bottom of my heart. And if you are taking care of yourself, that's good. That made you you at a higher vibration than most people. Because a lot of people think, oh, if I go get my nails done, my toes done, and my wig, my lace front snatched, and oh, if I go buy some designer this, uh, fucking dollar pair of shoes, they think that make them feel better. But that really don't. And you know, once you raise your vibrations, and, and, and find what truly make you happy you won't realize how pointless all that shit was but that's not what this video is about this video is about how spirituality is about to become the next big trend that we all see like we all know what trends is we all hopped on trends um or we all have hopped on trends and this spiritual shit mark my words it's about to become a trend and it's nothing to play with I'm not smiling. I'm smirking. Because I'm goofy, but I'm not smiling. This spiritual shit is about to become a trend, and I hate it so much. I, I'm pissed. I'm mad. I'm so mad. I'm so upset about this because this shit is not nothing to play with. And it's not as easy or, or, or as sweet as you think. Like, this spiritual shit is the real deal, Holyfield. And if you come in this shit, hopping on the bandwagon you gonna get lost in the sauce and it's gonna fuck with you mark my words um i've been seeing a lot of people you know posting and, and y'all y'all might be seeing the exact same thing i know y'all seeing a lot of people post um crystals they getting crystals a lot of people is getting sage it's starting to use sage and um um if you don't know what crystals is it's the, the little rock they look like gems they look like rocks it's crystals like those things and sage is the it's like a let me show y'all sage hold on matter of fact i'll show y'all crystals too this is a crystal a crystal it's beautiful right it's the real deal holy feel i wish my camera would focus let me see what a crystal is this is a beautiful crystal this is my favorite crystal 
this is sage you burn it and it is to cleanse i hope bad energy and bad spirits and I, a, a lot y'all gonna start seeing this more often i already know y'all seeing it a lot because that's all i'm starting to see on my instagram like out of nowhere um these the, both of these things hold a lot of power and it's about to be trending and it's about to be the new next thing you know the new hottest thing and and you gotta be careful when you're using it first of all let's talk let's just this video is not about um vibrations this video is strictly about how spirituality is about to become a trend but i need to touch on this so it could all tie into it and i'm trying to make this video as quick as possible you heard me because i hate editing fucking 30 minute videos because my ass can't shut up so i'm gonna just talk about vibrations real quick and i need to make a video on vibrations like strictly vibrations because when i talk about vibrations and you at a low vibration or you just not into aka you not into spirituality when i'm talking in these words y'all don't really understand what i'm talking about because the vibration is low okay so i'm gonna make a whole video on vibrations later on but right now i'm gonna just touch into vibrations if you are vibrating at a low frequency i'll explain how do you know if you vibrate at a low frequency in another video about vibrations so be on the lookout for that but if you're vibrating at a low frequency right a very low vibe frequency if you're vibrating at a low frequency on a daily basis it is so easy for you to get fooled and tricked into getting caught up in this matrix shit when i say matrix shit i mean it's this this uh evil world this materialistic world that's basically what the matrix is that's what i call it it's like just the materialistic side of the world which is social media uh the ego all that type. i'm gonna leave that for another video but if your vibrations are low you are most likely on instagram posting pictures hoping they get the most likes hoping they get the most comments if your vibrations are low you most likely care about fucking insta social media likes retweets um if your vibrations are low you do anything for some clout right if your vib vibrations are low you out there hurting other people if your vibrations are low you most likely out there fucking anything that you see walking if your vibrations are low you most likely probably not being the best version of yourself and i know I, I, that's just facts and if it hurts your feelings because you're doing any of those things then you vibrating low and i'm sorry that it hurt your feelings but i can say it because at one point i was doing those things until i woke the fuck up so just because everybody do the shit that's a trend or you're not the only one doing it or most people your age is on this on this trend that doesn't mean it's that's something good or or it makes it acceptable know that please know that just because everybody else is doing it most people your age doing it doesn't make it acceptable it don't that means you're vibrating at a fucking low frequency a very low frequency like your vibrations is so low and i say all that to say you need to be mindful of your vibrations because when they low, you you are susceptible, susceptible. Well, whatever the fuck you say, it you you're you're, you're a higher risk of falling into the traps that's being thrown on a daily basis. Is what I'm trying to say. So, with the spirituality, all that being said, but all that being said, I'm trying to say, if your vibrations are low, you most likely the, likely the first one to hop on the fucking um. Uh, the newest TikTok trend, the newest TikTok dance. You, 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 you probably the, the first one to hop on the shade room comments. If a celebrity dumb, if a celebrity have done some dumb shit, right? And the shade room posted a ball alert, posted or whatever blog site post post the shit. You the first person to go into that, leave a hate comment, or you the first person to go on there and argue with some fucking ten year old behind that keyboard, like all that is you the first one to fall for some fucking 
room of a celebrity that don't have anything to do with you. Your vibration is low. You vibrating at very low frequency. You need to start being aware of that because that's how they trap you. When I say they, I mean the fucking government. Okay? So this is the agenda that they about to push with with, with the spirituality shit. And I can get so deep into this shit and make this video a 30 minute video, but I'm, <laughs> I'm really gonna try my hardest not to do that. But mark my words the spiritual shit is about to get plastered everywhere they're gonna be selling crystals and and walmarts and dollar stores they already are fucking amazon um everywhere that you shop everywhere that you look you're gonna start seeing crystals and sage and y'all need to take heed to this please take heed to this please 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 i don't know why i want to help y'all so bad y'all motherfuckers probably don't even give a fuck two fucks about me but i try to be I, I try to look at it like you know i try to look at it from a perspective like it, that's not really y'all you heard me y'all just never had somebody to come at you with this type of information so that's why i'm like so willing to help but you heard me you have to want to put in the work yourself and you, you can't be so quick to judge other people because it, it might be I might be sent here on to get in front of this camera and say some shit that might help you in your life because the videos that I watched on YouTube have helped me form into this person and it changed my life for the better. Nobody in my family could have done that for me. It was a complete stranger who I never fucking met. You heard me, so don't be so quick to judge. But these crystals is, is, is I mean, the spiritual shit is, is about to get um, very marketed all over um the tv social media with celebrities and i need y'all to just be careful it, it I, i'm starting to see and i know y'all starting to see a lot of um people on your timeline posting them saging or then the, all of a sudden the most ratchetest bitch fucking using her crystals all of a sudden to sage in her house or you know people that you know is probably bad people was all of a sudden starting to do this type of shit and participate in this type of shit like all of a sudden like talking like the last month or so right and i've been starting to see let me just tell y'all the agenda i think the agenda is going to be so december 21st happened a uh, 22nd whatever the day was when the planets aligned and it created this huge creative shift right that happened, and I'm not gonna lie, I don't know about y'all, but I've seen a lot of change in people, random change, like out the blue, like I'm talking about just random ass change. It's starting to happen with people, and people starting to wake up, and people were starting to realize how energy is, that type of change. So, so, if you notice that, Please know that you're not the only one who noticed that. People, other people who are more powerful than me and you have noticed the change too. People who are in control of the whole matrix shit, AKA who are in control of the whole entire world and how the world is set up. I'm not gonna say, I don't wanna say that word too much because I don't want that type of hate on my videos, but I pop people in power, like people who actually have the power, trust and believe they on to this shit that I talk about. And they on to this shit that every fucking spiritual person talk about. They on to it. They notice the change, right? So what they gonna try to do is the agenda, I believe the agenda is about to be, okay, people is changing, people is waking up. Oh my God, panic. You hear me like the system is about to, well I'm not about to, it's already fucking crumbling. So instead of being like you know putting it out there like oh the spiritual shit is evil because that's what y'all thought everybody thought this at one point and don't say you haven't because if you say that you cap it i even thought that i thought the spiritual shit was some evil shit i thought this the, you know was some illuminati type of shit we all did that's what we was taught that's that was being pushed our whole entire life so that's what we automatically thought until i started to do research or you started to do research to you find out the truth but so they know niggas is not scared of you no more 
they know December 21st, December 22nd happened, and they know people are starting to wake up to the shit that is happening in the world. People been waking up, but a lot of people, like a mass majority of people all over the globe, this is not just a US thing, is starting to wake up. People in power know this. Please know this. These people are smart. That's how they created everything that happens in this matrix ass world. They smarter than us, but they're not smarter than God. Remember that. These people know, they, they feel a change, they see it, they study y'all, they study us. I think they gonna push the spiritual shit. They gonna push the fuck out of it. Like I'm saying, you gonna see it in Walmart, you gonna see it on TV commercials, shit is gonna be so, it, it, anything spiritual is about to be pushed in your face to the point where you low vibrational ass people it's going to fall for the trap and y'all going to dive in that shit head first and y'all not going to know what the fuck y'all fucking with. And I feel sorry for you. I, I really hope a lot of people come across this video before y'all dive into spiritual shit. Because it's things that you have to do mentally and first before you ever touch a crystal. Before you ever bring some crystals into your house. They're not going to tell you that part though. Trust and believe the government not gonna put that on the TV commercials, but they gonna have these motherfuckers all over the Walmart TV commercials soon. I give it a month. It's already happening. Start paying attention. It's already happening. They gonna push this in y'all face just like they push a new TikTok dance in y'all face. You hear me? <laughs> they gonna push this shit like they push fucking Kim Kardashian Kanye West drama in y'all face. You know when some shit happened with the Kardashians, it's all over social media. When some shit happened with Black Lives Matter, it's all over social media. They about to push the spiritual shit because they have no other choice. They can't keep telling y'all, oh, it's, it's some evil shit, it's some Illuminati type shit because niggas is knowing that it's not that. You hear me? If you want to keep thinking that's that, then that's on you. But niggas is, niggas is starting to, you know, it's not that people know that now so they have no other choice but to roll with it and 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 and, and lead y'all out here to go head first but they only gonna lead the low vibrational they only going they only able to trap the people who is trappable you hear me and you trappable if your vibrations is low if you're the first one to hop on some celebrity drama shit on the shade room if you the first one to comment on that shit if you the first one to 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 post a celebrity that died that you don't even know never even met your vibrations were very low you have to realize what you're doing you letting let's just use a celebrity guest as an example i'm gonna use king von because i know this nigga never rapped about anything positive king von right passed away you know that was a very bad thing that happened and prayers up to his family but rappers like this pass away that y'all never met who never did anything positive for you you hear me never made a positive song in his life if he did that wasn't what got pushed so don't come at me in the comments but if you go to this go to this nigga track right here everything that he put out was negativity about killing murders all the bodies he got guns drugs sex none of that did anything for you to make you a better man or a better woman or a better human period none of it and that's just facts if you refuse to believe that then i'm pretty sure your vibrations is low anyways this nigga died right people fall apart i was one of them that's why i can't talk shit like this because I know what y'all went through. I didn't fall apart, but I definitely was on social media posting R.I.P. King Vine, you know. The shit fuck with you a little bit. If you if you put your emotions into these people who you never met, your vibrations is low. I'm saying all that to say, when these celebrities die, you let that affect you. People that you never met now, niggas you never met, never will, who never did anything positive for you. Think about this, when they pass away, you let that affect you to the point where you sad for the whole day. And y'all might not think that's much, but 
you know, that's your whole day that could have been used to make you richer or could could have been, that's valuable time that you can't get back. But you spent that day talking about this dude all day, right? You never met him and he never did anything positive for you. That's just an example of, of, of um, how they feed off of your energy and, um, um, and, and how they trap you, how they get you in the traps. They kill off celebrities, they, they make certain shit blow up so you can fall in the trend, shit like that. With the spiritual shit, they gonna push it, get ready. They are about to push the fuck out of it. I'm seeing it already. I'm seeing it already. I'm about to sum this video up real quick because I really don't want it to be long. But I just want y'all to know, when dealing with the spiritual shit, it's not as easy as buying this and coming to your house, lighting this shit up, and, and, and saging your house. It's not that simple. That's not all it is. You playing with this shit and you don't know what this shit is, you don't even want to go on Google and do research on it. You just seen the, the, the bitch who you know got her only fans take fucking sage, go in her house and sage her house. You seen the bitch who got her, who got her only fans. Nah, she, she actively got her only fans. You seen this bitch. Get these crystals. Post it on her Instagram and say, oh, but no bad vibes 2021. Some dumb shit. The bitch who got her only fans. B, they about to push this spiritual shit on y'all. And if you if you if you if you fuck with these crystals or you fuck with anything spiritual and you dive head first in that shit, you gonna experience some shit that is bad. Because the spiritual world is nothing to play with. It's 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 real. Your whole life you was told that the shit is evil, the shit is some Illuminati type shit. Um if you go talk to Billy Bob and Joe about some spiritual shit or some spirits or anything that dealing that's dealing with the spiritual world they gonna tell you they had a bad experience and this shit is evil but it ain't it's only evil if you don't know what the fuck you're doing it's only evil if you're not vibrating at a high frequency that's why I'm talking about vibration so much that's why vibrations is so important before you fuck with anything spiritual please your home I'm, I'm, I'm begging y'all don't dive head first into this shit I'm about to end this video. I'll probably make a part two if y'all really want me to make a part two. But we just gonna keep it at crystals and sage because I know y'all seeing that the most on social media right now. These crystals don't. <laughs> Yo, I seen Taco post something. Taco Tarantino, shout out to her, man. She a real one. She keep it so real, dog. It's so refreshing to see somebody who 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 is blunt and honest like that. I be trying to be nice to y'all, but some people don't give a fuck, and I appreciate that. But 